Hi besties, welcome back to my channel. Thank you so much for stopping back by or if you're new here, hi, my name is Jen. Thank you so much for visiting my channel. I truly, truly appreciate it. We're here for yet another Timu haul. I have maybe about 10 items here I'm gonna go through um, and yeah, that's really about it, but I'm gonna take my time with them. I thought that might be easier than doing like a super long haul. <laughs> so maybe about a half hour, maybe even not, but you know, hey, we're all busy people. It is summer. We need to get outside with our kids. Or maybe it's not summer where you're at. I don't know. I actually think it's winter in Australia. So that's kind of, that's different. But anywho, all right. Got a short Timu haul, kind of random. Couple clothing items, couple home decor items, couple of beauty items, you know, all the things. That's how we do it here. Variety is the spice of life. So uh, thank you so much for joining me. I will have put all the links to all the items down below in the, descrip the uh, description box. Can't talk today. And um, yeah, so I guess that's it. Let's just roll right into this, shall we? Um, just so you know, this, this sweater is a Timu sweater. This necklace um, is from... Park Lane Jewelry, I believe. Yes, this is a wig I'm wearing. It's from Chelsea Smith Cosmetics in the style Kylie Apricot with Bangs. I think I love it. I love the color. I normally wear a lot of lighter blonde wigs, but this is kind of different and new for me, and that's what I love about wigs is I can try different hairstyles, different colors, and I don't have to dye my hair, so... Uh, yeah, I think that's all I'm actually wearing. Oh, well, no, wait. This ring is from Timu as well. Love it. And then also my nails are from Timu. So, okay, let's just get right into this, shall we? Glasses are also from Timu. I get a lot of reading glasses from Timu. Um, yeah, I, I mean, I have astigmatism, so I can't really wear them to work when I work, but I can wear them for everything else, for reading and my phone and doing hauls and those kind of things. Okay, let's just get right into this. Let's just take this right off the top. A little Timu bag action going on here. It was $12.89. I believe this is a kimono. Are we shocked? Are we shocked it's a kimono? No, we're not shocked. We're not shocked at all. It's got to be a kimono because that's this is that's what I do here. I buy kimonos <laughs> and nails and rings. So it's got this really nice black and white print, which I love. Um, and is this the one I bought with the fringe? Ooh, yes, it is. Yes, ma'am. I will put a picture up of what this looks like. Um, on the model, just so you know, um, it's a very light fabric, very, very light fabric, kind of polyester-y, um, like here's, it's got a very big, like, arm area, but it, there is a, like, a pin in the, like, a pin, well, actually, it's sewn together for maybe, like, about, I'd say about 10 inches right there, but the bottom of this is the star of the show, because the bottom is fringe, and I love it. I think that's adorable. Very Western kind of style. So, yeah. So, see the picture. I probably posted it by now for what it looks like on the model, just so you know. Um, I, usually, these kinds of things are kind of like one size fits all. They usually come pretty big, but I really like the pattern. Um, and they're very, very light and comfy. Like I've said a million times, you guys, I know I, know I probably should just learn to love my body, but... I am very self-conscious of my arms, so I'm always wearing, like, sleeves, and so in the summer, I buy tank tops, wear these really loose, flowy, light kimonos, and kind of cover my arms, but still give me a little bit of air to breathe, <laughs> so, hey, we're working on it. We're all, I'm always a work in progress, you know? Okay, next are these hair combs, hair bands combs. Um, you get a set of four. They were $2.24. I think that's a pretty good deal for four hair bands. Hair band? Is that what I want to call these? Hair... I don't want to call it a hair band. What do I... Is that what it is? I don't know. What do you... What, what would you guys call these? Hair combs? Because there's like a comb on it too. But it's like a... I don't know. Either way, you get a, a black one, a blue one, and then there's like a tan, and then there's like a lighter tan kind of thing but I really like them because they will hold in the hair um you know when you push them back headband I guess you I guess you could say they're headbands um but they're just headbands with the teeth in them so you can like pull your hair back I I, I mean I really like using these but since this one kind of already broke off one of these little teeth I mean 
for $224, if you have really super thick hair, which I don't, I mean, my wigs, I mean, you know, I was just going to pull back a wig maybe with this, and then that way it would stay in the wig, because when you buy a new wig, the hair tends to be very, very soft. Um, so yeah, if you have really super thick hair, I would bet that these would probably break on you maybe, but I mean, four of them for $224, that's not bad. I don't think that's a bad price. I mean, I'd probably get the same thing at um, Dollar Tree, I guess, maybe. Along with the headband is this headband. Now, this one has hair on it. Uh, it was $4.49. This is very, very close to my bio hair, um, which I try and keep my wigs pretty close to my bio hair. The color number, it says brown. This is this is not brown by, by any stretch of the imagination, I don't think. I mean, look at that. It has some... Uh, the thing I do like about this is that it does have some dimension to it. Um, looking at it, there is some like lighter blonde. There's some golden blonde. There might be a little bit of a darker blonde. So I'm going to use this with a couple of my wigs as well. Um, one thing I would do with this, I'm probably going to spray some uh, dry shampoo on it to take away the shine. But I mean, the hair looks really good. You know what I mean? Like for faux hair. I think it looks really good. Um, I do like that these are covered down here, so they're not going to, like, hurt your ears or anything. But I have a wig that the color matches very well with this. So I would more call this an ashy type of blonde shade, like a cool, neutrally ashy blonde. But the hair looks real. Um, I like... I also will probably pull a couple strands out to make it look more natural and then also dry shampoo, probably a little bit of uh, hairspray just to keep it in shape. But yeah, I think it's really cute um, for $4.49. Yeah, I really like that. I think it's really cute. It'll look really cute on a wig or even if I'm not wearing a wig, it's very, very close to my bio hair. So really like that. I'm guessing this is probably a pair of readers. It says reading glasses on it. They were $4.79 in flowered tortoiseshell. Ooh, it sounds, sounds fun. Okay, we will try these on. These are like, I love these. I have a thing for cat eye glasses. I don't know what it is, but I absolutely love cat eye glasses. I am like a big... If I could have lived in any time period beside like the 1800s or like Game of Thrones era, I would love to have lived in the 40s and 50s, um, somewhere in there. <laughs> Even into the 70s wouldn't be too bad. But so yeah, these were $4.79. They are a flowery tortoiseshell type of look. It looks like they're, they've got some pink in there, some purple, black. This is what they look like out of the package. Look how pretty those are. Wow, I love those. I got them in a 2.75. That's a little bit higher than I normally go, but I, I feel like my eyes are getting a little bit bad. So very well made, very sturdy. Um, oh my gosh. So guys, I hauled a pair of black cat eye reading glasses, I think maybe four or five hauls ago. Well, yeah, I sat on those and broke them. So this is why I buy my readers off of Timu. I do like that Timu's readers are better quality than Dollar Tree. Like normally I'd just go buy a dollar, uh, like a pair from Dollar Tree and like not even think twice about it. But I like the quality, quality of these better. Oh my gosh. They fit so good. <gasps> I love these. I love these. And there's, this area is big enough that it doesn't get in the way. Like how adorable are these? Stinking adorable love them okay yes these are an absolute yes 479 for those very well made they've got a lot of nice little like bits of gold right here so yeah love those all right put them back in here 479 for those yeah love them okay next is <laughs> you guys <laughs> I bought this a million times. I know you've seen me buy these before. They are like candle rings or small wreaths. I have so many of these in the different styles. You get two pieces for $7.20, so that's, you know, $3.70 a piece somewhere in there. And these are fabulous. I use them as candle rings. I use them as wreaths up on my wall. I, I use them everywhere. Um, usually the ones that I... This is the first time I bought this particular style. It's like a eucalyptus leaf. Uh, actually, they're all just eucalyptus on this particular one. The other ones I bought have, have had like a 
like a white type of berry on them, I guess. But yeah, when you get them out, you kind of have to zhuzh them a little bit. But they're really pretty. I mean, they are just so pretty. Um, but you gotta mess with them a little bit. Like just any, just like any other uh, greenery from, I almost said Dollar Tree, from Timu. Um, and you can always, if this doesn't seem like thick enough for you, double these up. I mean, for seven bucks for two, you really can't, you really can't beat that. But I like the, just the plain eucalyptus. I might use these outside because I have a couple of lanterns with candles outside on the deck and I would love to use these, um, for there. That's the plan anyway. Um, so, and I also have a couple of like tall, uh, cloches that are like wire. Yes, I would definitely be using these in there. So yeah, go get yourself a couple battery operated candles for like 10 bucks and then two of these rings for like seven bucks. You've got a really cute little vignette for like under 20. So highly recommend these. I All three of the styles, I think this comes in like three different styles. There's this eucalyptus one. There's one, like I said, that has the little like white berries and then there's one other one which might have lilac on it, but I'm not sure. But yeah, I've bought these probably five times now, at, at, at least five times. I love them. Okay, next is a, probably a shirt maybe, or a kimono, <laughs> one or the other. It was $7.99, 3XL, bought it in a 3XL. It's hard, so hard to say like what size to get stuff in sometimes. I always go big because thinking, well, if I, if I shrink it, it's not a complete loss or whatever, but Okay, what is this? Is it a tank top? I will also put a photo in of this. Um, oh, there's a, there's a pearl bead, bead, yeah, a pearl button back here. But it's not a pearl. Kind of looks like a pearl, but it's not. Let's see if I can get this on here. Yeah, there we go. Okay, I think it's a tank top. Yeah. So here I am with the high neck tank tops again, but this one has like a crocheted effect in the front. This is kind of see-through, so, mm, but it's very big and flowy, so it will definitely fit for sure. But I love the neckline of these when it looks like this. Love that. So yeah, very big though. So yeah, even if I shrink it, it's not going to be a total loss, but I will. I will make sure I put a picture up of that so you can see what it looks like on the model. So yeah, $79 for that, $7.99 and I got it in like a dark gray. Can't be dark gray, it matches with everything. <clears throat> okay, I have these three left. Let's do this one and then we'll do these two because these two might be the same thing. <laughs> two boxes of the same thing. I do that a lot. So I got another set of these um, eyeshadow sticks, which I don't, I don't wear a whole lot of eyeshadow. When I do, I want it to be super easy, super simple, ready to go, like, don't even want to think about it. I bought a couple sets of these. The last set that I hauled, now this one was only $4.99, um, but I think they're all from like the same seller. Why can't I get in here? Why can't I get into this thing? But um, yeah, they, they sell like three packs of like different shades. So whatever whatever shades you like, you should get. The last set I got was like, um, like a black or really dark brown. And then like another brown that wasn't as dark. And then a white color these lean towards the pink or mauve type of shade and you know what i noticed on these ones is there's actually color numbers on the bottom so this one for instance is color 181 hopefully that's focusing but i doubt it and then this is color number 186 and then this one is color number 10 i think that says or wait 10 or 01 it's 01 sorry Oh, one. So yeah, these, these are like in the pink family. I really like these. They all have a brush at the end that you can blend with. So let's just look at these shades real quick. This looks like a matte, but maybe. Yeah, it's like a matte pink. I don't really see a, that's the color 01 is this first one right here. Next is 181. This, this shade I love. It's a little bit, leans a little purpley, but purple mauve ish there's that one and then the last one is 186 it's a little bit deeper of a shade although it's more pink which i love that too i don't i don't hate this for an eyeshadow color number 186 is this one so that's the three of them together the other reason I like these is usually these shades are pretty coordinating so if if you want to create a look you can do it with 
two of these shades, all three. You can want to start, you know, with your lighter color and work your way out to your darker shades. So yeah, I mean, you can mix and match these pretty well. That's the other reason I like these is the shades kind of coordinate, which is really nice. So yeah, love those. I think they have like a, I wish I would have bought, and I probably have to be honest, I just haven't got it yet. They have a set that's like 10 or 12 of these and they're great. They're really creamy, very easy to blend. So this is what they look like not blended out, but just, I'll just take the end of this one here and show you. There's like this really nice brush at the end and you just literally go over it really lightly, really lightly. And it blends out really, really nice. So yeah, really like these. I mean, also these come, I think they're the local warehouse item um, because these were delivered by Amazon today. So I don't know. I'm, I'm like iffy on the local warehouse items. I haven't personally got a price adjustment, but I know other people have with the local warehouse items. Um, I have not. That doesn't mean you won't. I just go by what I know. And so far, I have not got a price adjustment on any of those items. But maybe it depends on the seller. Okay. So these are probably the same thing. Because they both say 346 One says blue. One says green. I think I know what these are. <laughs> I think I was going to use these outside in my garden. Um, oh, shoot. Styrofoam alert. Styrofoam alert. Ugh. Let me pull it out. Ooh. Okay, these are uh, ceramic fish, and then it comes with this um, steel tubing. You just push this up in there, and then you push the steak like down into a plant, or wherever you want to put these. You can put them, you know, in between plants, or you know, in. I thought they would look cool, like if I had a big like you know, area where there is plants, I could put these like going through in different directions, but I really like the pattern on them. I mean, <laughs> they look really cool. I love the color because my, I'm, I'm doing my thought process on my deck right now, which we're working, still working on is like dark gray, almost black is going to be the deck color. And then I'm going to have some like turquoise, blue, green, white, lots of candles, lots of water features and so yeah, I thought these were really cool. Anyway, so yeah, that was three forty-six. So the other one is the same thing, only a different color. These came in several different colors. Um, I just bought the one, you know, in the colors that I liked. I think they had like a yellow and a red. I bought all the like bluish green ones. I think I bought more of these too in different colors, but all right, let's get this out of here and try not to make a mess with the styrofoam. Ooh, this one's pretty. Look at him. Look at that. Look at the blue on that. It's beautiful. Look at that. Wow. I love it. So I just thought, you know, these would look really pretty in with some plants, you know, or something. I don't know. I just thought they would look really, really cool. And I love fish and, and nature and all those kind of things. So, but yeah, they come with these little sticks you put on, put them on and you can just stick them into pots or into your garden, like where your gardening stuff is, or wherever you want to put them. They could even sit in a, if you didn't want to put the stick in them, you could probably, they're heavy enough, they're not super heavy, but you could probably put these in a water feature. Like I have a, one of my fountains is big cement and it's very shallow, so I think I could probably just sit a couple of these in there in the water. I think that would look great too. So yeah, is that it? Was that my haul? Well, okay, that was it. Wow, kind of quick, but that's okay, right? Short, short is better than nothing. <laughs> Late's better than never too, right? Okay, so yeah, really like these. I'm pretty sure I got those and maybe a couple other colors probably will be in the next haul, but thank you so much for watching and sticking around. Please like and subscribe if you are so inclined. I would really appreciate that. And thank you so much for watching, and I will see you in the next one. Bye!